That's West Virginia up next for Kentucky. UK leads the all time series with WVU 15 and 5. Cal is 12 and 7 all time as a coach against the Mountaineers. Bob Huggins just 1 and 4 all time against UK. None of the series history matters though once the ball is tipped Saturday night at 7 o'clock over on ESPN. It's these two teams that will be competing, these two programs both trying to outwork and outgrind to get a win. There's no doubt it'll be physical. The Cats said Cal's been throwing some extra bodies on the floor to guard them, managers and all. What we're trying to do is let them know it's going to be a physical game and I don't want to hear anything about fouls. I'm getting fouled. I'd like to come over and see something on the court that I did not see. You did not see him grab my arm. I don't care. You're going to have to be physical in this game. You're going to have to meet people before they meet you. You're going to have to be strong with the ball. It's all things you have to do in a game like this. But it's not only against West Virginia. It's probably just about every game we play. It's the same thing. Kentucky's out of the top 25. West Virginia, a top 10 team. UK has three solid top 50 RPI victories to date over Louisville, Virginia Tech, and Texas A&M. This one against WVU, though, would be the signature win of the season. It's a must win. Right side blue fans, ESPN's college game day will be on hand to hype it all up. Cats and Mountaineers, the primetime 7 o'clock tip in the Big 12 SEC showdown. It's a must win, right, Coach Cal? This is only a big game if we win. Now, it's a huge game. But short of that, it's the next game, and it's not even in our league. It's, it's going to be a hard game, but it's not a must game. And I would say... Uh, Bob Huggins is saying the same thing. It's, it's going to be a hard game, but it's not in our league. They win it. It's a big game for them. We win it. It's a big game for us. So it's only a must win or big win if you win. That's Cal's stance. As for the Cats themselves, it's a must win because it would be a big win, and the team is tired of losing. I like going in there as an underdog now because we ain't win no big games yet. So this is probably we, this is the game we're going to win. So we got to come out this win at this time. Definitely. I mean, this is a big game for us. I mean, big game for us as a team, big game for us as a, as a whole unit. And we just got to go out there and leave it all on the floor. I mean, losing isn't a fun, losing isn't a fun feeling. Got to win this game. This is a must-win game for us. Why? Why? Because we've been, we've been, oh, we've been losing, we've been losing. <laughs> and everybody doubting us, so we got, we got to punch them in their mouth. Strong words from Quanah Green. If that wasn't enough to get you pumped for tomorrow's matchup against West Virginia, how about the fact the managers have been throwing the pads on the Cats? This physical war that's being built will not go to the victor of the first four minutes. It'll be the last man standing after 40, and UK knows it. Uh, it's, it ain't no pressure, really. I'm being an underdog now, that's not what everybody used to on our, on our team being an underdog, so we just got to come out and fight. They're being aggressive with us, fouling us, hitting us with pads. I mean, just being able to play through the little bumps and the little grinds. I mean, it's going to be a war out there. It's going to be it's gonna be us versus them. It's a game, basketball game at the end of the day, so you got, either you're going to come to play or you ain't going to come to play.